Hi everyone, it's Miss Sarah. I wanted to start um, doing our behavior basics. So I thought I would start it today and we'll read it every day like we normally do in school. So this week we are going to talk about the basics of communication. How do we talk to people? So first, before we start, remember we need to go over our rules. So our rules for when we have group. Rule number one, our mouth is quiet. Rule number two, my eyes are looking. Rule number three, I keep my hands and feet to myself. My feet are on the floor and my body is facing forward. Rule number four, my ears are listening. And rule number five, if you have a question or you need help, you need to raise your hand. Okay, communication basics. Talk to people, there are a few things that I need to remember. The first thing I need to remember is to always respect our personal space when talking to someone. So we need to make sure that we're standing the right amount away from somebody so we're not too close and in their bubble. When I am talking, I should not be touching someone, hovering over them, or be so far away from that, that, them that you need to scream. You can. Think about being an arm's length away. The second thing I need to remember when talking to someone is to make sure that I'm looking at them. So if you're talking to someone and you're looking over here, do you think that person knows that you're talking to them? Probably not. So you need to make sure that your eyes are looking at the person you're talking to. This shows the speaker or the listener that you care about the conversation, that you're listening and that you want to talk back with them. The last thing I need to remember when having a conversation is to use the appropriate volume. You don't want to walk to talk too quiet and you don't want to talk too loud. You can just use your voice or use your device at the right level. If someone is whispering, the listener will struggle to hear you if you're talking about them. Unless you're telling a secret, then that's okay. Or playing phone tree. Wow! Ah, but if the someone is shouting, ah, that hurts my ears. I may not want to listen to you because you're being too loud. When having a conversation, it is important to be respectful. So make sure that your body is facing forward, your eyes and your ears are listening and looking at the person. My friends, my family, my teachers will say, great job being a good listener, being a good speaker. So proud of you. Nice work. The end. Okay, so that's what we're going to be learning about this week how you can communicate. So you could practice at home by talking to your siblings, talking to your grandma, talking to your mom and dad, your dog. <laughs> you could practice how to communicate with someone. So I'm going to leave a link at the bottom of this screen. Hopefully it'll appear in the comments and it will be a link to a story called Decibella. Okay, so that will be the story associated. Okay, I think that's all. I will see everyone tomorrow on day two of our Behavior Basics. Have a great Monday. Bye.